Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We're taking a look at another Coachman. This one having the most beautiful exterior and the most beautiful interior with an awesome layout. This is a 2022 Coachman Encore Model 325SS. We are gonna take a look at the outside features first and the inside features then we're gonna give you three things we love about the Encore and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video. If you saw yesterday's video on the Leprechaun, you guys know I was critiquing Coachman big time. And if you haven't seen that video, We'll link it down in the description below. But I want everybody to know that I wasn't picking on Coachman. I was picking on the Leprechaun. Now this Encore Andrea, I am super excited about. I'm confident everybody that lost their faith in Coachman is gonna make it fall back up with this beautiful motorhome. But before I begin, I would like to say hi to Andrea. Hey Andrea. Hi everyone. How's it going today? It's going good. Uh I'm super excited. I love Coachman. Yes. Um, this is a beautiful floor plan. Yes. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy it. Yes, and I love Coachman too. That's why we're allowed to critique it <laughs> when they do something wrong. But let me tell you guys, America, when they do, I'm going to speak up when they do something wrong. But when they do something right, I'm going to speak up even louder. Let's begin. Model is Encore 325 SS. The actual tip to tip length of this motorhome is 35 feet, four inches. This is the Coachman Encore. It is Coachman's top of the line, class A gas motorhome, but it's still a tier four. This isn't a, I mean, this is a tier three. It's not a tier four. This doesn't compete with your Bounder new Mars, your Bounders, yeah. but it's, it's in a really good price range. This is like, so for Coachman, it does, it's not to the emblem level, it's to like the Vision XL level. Yes. A nice tier three, but I love this. Look at the front paint job. Look at the little cutout right there, I love that. Look at this front grill, Andrea. The grill matters. Grills matter. This reminds me of a GMC Denali. Look at these headlight designs, okay? As you guys know, we did just get an Integra Odyssey from RVR that we're demoing. I asked for an Encore, and they're like, no, it's a little too much money, man. I'm like, all right. Hey, dream big, huh? But look, I love the lights. Even like the detail with the coloring right here it just looks so good, and I love that. Coming on down the side here, we do have big chrome mirrors right there, left side and right side. Cameras on the left side and right side. There's also a camera in reverse. Also, if you back up, look at the beautiful full body paint job. We've actually never seen one here. Back up this way, please. We've never seen one this color. It looks absolutely fantastic. Partial body paint is standard. Full body paint's the option. But quite frankly, Andrea, I'm not getting this motorhome without full body paint. You know what I'm saying? I hear ya. And then, because it's 2022, it does have the 7.3 liter V8. It has the Godzilla engine. <laughs> 350 horsepower and 468 pound-feet of torque. Do you know what size Godzilla that was? Um, it wasn't as big as normal. Oh, it wasn't? No, it was, I don't know, size seven? No, <laughs> it was supposed to be a Texas size oh, Godzilla. no, you gotta do that again. Godzilla! There you go, that's Texas style. Everything's bigger in Texas. That's right. And then look at these tires, we're ready to the Michelin's. 255-80R22.5 with the shiny alcohol rims. And if you guys don't know, we are at our, one of our Texas dealerships, Motorhome Specialist. Um, and then because this is a Coachman, Andrea, does have the Asdell sidewall composite, which is a green base material that will never delaminate on you. And then check this out. Not one, but two huge power awnings with LED lights. I absolutely love that. Frameless windows. And then check out what we got going on here. TV on the outside. 40 inch. Oh, look at that. Storage. Pass through. Yes. There's your inverter. Very, very nice. Very good storage. Fiberglass slam latch doors. Not aluminum, but again, it's not to the bounder level. It's more like a Fortis. 
So right here's the propane. We can put all the specs here, bing, for everybody who's watching on television. Power on the outside. And then look at this, very nice storage. And Andrea, I'm so sorry to annoy you. Look at this paint one more time. It's crazy to think that this isn't uh, top, top, top I of the know. line. It looks, the paint job looks like it. Yeah. There is a quick connect right there if you want a, a propane grill. And look at this. Outside kitchen. Absolutely, a little refrigerator. Check it out. A sink that's plumbed through with a drain pump. Storage under right there. Look at that sink. Storage right there. Oh, and then also Andrea. Soft close. Nice. Soft close. Oh, Matt, you forgot the most important part. What's that? Oh, that's not a beer opener. You thought that was a beer opener? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Andrea. I did, I did. Psh, America. Oh, my gosh. Now, Andrea, do you know why people hate outside kitchens on motorhomes? Takes up room. Takes up storage. Yeah. Not with the Encore. Let's don't. see it. Boom. Oh, Look nice. at that storage. Isn't that amazing? That is awesome. Yes, ma'am. Coming around the back, Andrea. Oh. 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 Oh, my foot got soaking wet. Oh, okay. Uh. So you see that? So look, no ladder to get up on the back. I'm going around. 5,000 pound hitch. This motorhome can tow 5,000 pounds. Look at the dual coloring here. Look right there. It looks so super nice and fantastic. I love this. This grass is getting my feet soaking wet, but I do this for you guys. Fuel fill up in the rear makes it easy to access on both sides. And Andrea, there you are. Andrea, how do you like the light design like that? I think it looks cool. Yep, yep. It, it looks cool and it's, it's not chrome, but the paint's a different color, so it gives it that chrome look, you know? And there's the backup camera right there. Okay. Thank you, ma'am. Other side of the storage. Yes. 50 amp power cord, no electric rail. Um, I mean, if they, so here's what I will say. If they did add an electric rail, I'd be like super impressed. But this price point, I don't expect nice. it, but it would be nice to have. I love the storage in here. Look at that storage. It's amazing. Andre, we can live in one of these. For real. Look at this. Beautiful. Andrea. Your hot water heater. That's what we're talking about. That is what we're talking about. Just continue the paint. Yep. It nice. looks fantastic. Nice wet bay. Beautiful wet bay, outdoor shower, potable water fill, water filtration system, everything. Right over here, Andrea. Is your, um, crap. What's it, not it's Yamaha. Probably, it's a, it's, it is yeah, Yamaha. Yamaha, Yamaha 5500 generator. And then let me tell you, Andrea, this motorhome's getting me fired up. We got some customers next to us buying another one. And look, we got storage right there. And um, not storage. But we'll still show it so they can see the automatic leveling. But Andre, here's what I want to let everybody know. It is cold. It is late in the day. Andre and I have been here filming all day. But this motorhome just gets me fired up. And let me tell you, Andrea, I promise you guys, as nice as the outside looks, it looks even better on the inside. Let's go, take a look. Here we go. Cargo carrying capacity, 5,264 pounds. That is impressive, impressive. All right, coming in, you can see we do have the slide in. I'm gonna do a little 360 here. A little 360 action. Oh my goodness. So look at this. Even with the slide in, look at the walkway. For a class A, this is still amazing. You can still open the refrigerator. And look, right here it gets a little bit tight, but totally doable. No problem at all. And then we've got the bathroom here and the bedroom, which looks like, yes, you can use the bed with the slide in. That's what I like. And Andrea, while I get the slide outs out, uh, I would like to give a big shout out to our sponsor, RV Life, who's doing an awesome promotion. Let's thank RV Life. Matt's RV Reviews is proudly sponsored by RV Life, tools that make camping simple. 
Everybody knows when it comes to camping, it can be a little stressful, but not with RV life. So first, discover. Research campgrounds and other locations of interest with detailed information, but for RVers. Plan your trip accordingly with the popular Trip Planner. That software is amazing. It's going to tell you the best routes, and you can go with your RV safe GPS. Not only are you typing in your specifications so it knows not to take you under any low bridges, but you can actually use that offline. So so if you're at a place with no Wi-Fi, you'll still have your GPS and you can share it with their RV community, guys. RV Life is more than just an app. It's an awesome program that all RVers should have. What we're doing is a free seven-day trial for Matt's RV Reviews customers and 25% off on top of that. So all you do is go to their website, rvlife.com, sign up for the free seven-day trial by clicking our link down below or typing in Matt's RV Reviews. Don't download the app because you, then you won't get the free seven days. So do it on the website, register Matt's RV Reviews, then download the app. We appreciate RV Life for sponsoring this video and sponsoring Matt's RV Reviews. Let's continue the video. Now Andrea, I'm gonna go a little off script today. Please come here, look at how beautiful this motorhome is with the slide out open. But let me tell you guys something, again, last episode, I was super critical. But this, they're both coachmen. It's amazing. The this difference. is what it's about. This is what a motorhome is supposed to look like. Now I know, I know the Leprechaun can't look as nice as this. I get that. But again, everything about this motorhome is beautiful. And even with this motorhome, this isn't even a bounder level. You know what I'm saying? And they still managed to make it look absolutely fantastic. Let's get started with the cockpit area. 7.3 liter V8. Got a little pen holder right here with a pen. Let's give this company a uh, Barboa dip or whatever. Auto leveling here, sun visors, dash fan, steering wheel. Andrea, sit in my co-captain seat. While she does that, we have a computer screen there. Not a computer screen, you know what I'm saying. It shows your cameras, left side, right side. Apple CarPlay, Android Auto. How do you feel? Oh, it's the last one of the day. Can I just sit here for a while? No, Andre, I'm amped up. This Isn't is very, it comfortable? I love these chairs. Yes. They're so comfortable. Yes. I, even, I love this too. Look at Look this. Look at that tray. Nice, sturdy tray for when you're working on the go. We got a privacy curtain here. Yes. We got some. Okay, um, Andrea, wait. New life goal, America. Let everybody comment below. We're at Motorhome Specialist. We got to get on that billboard. That is our 2022 goal. <laughs> 2022 goal, Andrea. Yeah. Look, look, look. You see how they have the Twilight 34699? Yes. That's interchangeable. Goal, life goal. Matt's RV reviews. <laughs> on that billboard. That is what Check we're doing. Your price. We're doing that for 2022. Sorry, Andrea. Continue with what you're saying. Okay, so we have the privacy curtain here. Yes. Both seats do swivel. Yes. And we, you got cup holders here. We got cabinets above here. Okay. Got the frosted look here. So nice. Okay, very nice. Yes. And, and then, then it is a bunk over the cab as well. Yes. Oh, yes. 300 pound limit on this bunk over the cab. Look at this. Bunk over the cab here holds 300 pounds. Okay, as so it's Andrea a good size. Said. Yep, yep. Um, It's okay. So then over here, so first and foremost, Andre, do you notice how light and bright it is? Yes. What they do here is not one, not two, but three strips of LED lights. Yes. I absolutely love that. That is a must have. Something else that's super cool, that's super new is. Oh, I love this. Oh man. Where'd you know, they put it? You know is how it up here? long Behind. it's gonna take. Andrea found the light switch, it's right here. Look at that. For more LED lights. So awesome. And then Andrea, for more natural skylight, which is a gray, cloudy, cold day. But look at that. I love that. It's so pretty. Look at that. It's... The, you know, I gotta say, Coachman is very innovative, and they're always doing really interesting new things, so... Again, I'll complain loud. <laughs> I will compliment louder. Yes. This is fantastic. Look at these lights. I love those. Look at this clock. Art Deco. Uh, no. <laughs> MCD privacy blinds very cute how cute do you like balances. the balances i always have liked them i think they're adorable storage underneath the dinette the two-tone color in here 
gray and cream. That actually is cute, you know? That's not too much. Drops down and makes a bed. Super, super comfortable. Then over here, we do have electric reclining chairs. Heated massage chairs. Look at this. You go, oh. Nice. Here we go now. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And the massage chair actually is a real massage. Well, not a real one. But it's a lot better than doesn't feel like sitting on a cell phone. You got your uh, remote holder there. Okay. Nice rest here. We got cabinets above, guys. There's also Very heated nice. seats. Oh, heated. I would love to sit in that right now. And then directly across, Andrea, is the TV Fireplace Entertainment Center. Starting down low, Fireplace produces heat from electricity. Coming up a bit, 40 inch 1080p TV. And then right here, a little bit more storage. You know why? Because you can never have enough. Never ever have enough, Andrea. And Andrea, would you like to show us the kitchen? I, yes, I would love to. But hey, I just want to say thanks everyone for st uh, stopping by to see us at the Tampa RV Show. Yes. We, we really, it was a pleasure to be all of you. And quite frankly, it was a pleasure to work with RV Retailer. Yes. And for those of you, if you haven't heard the news, we are now partnered with them. That means we have a nationwide network of RV dealerships. So if you want this motorhome or any motorhome, doesn't matter if you live in Florida, Texas, New York, or California, or anywhere in between, go to mattsrvreviews.com, fill out that contact tab, and what are we gonna get them, Andrea? The best price in America. A great price, great service, and quite frankly- A great experience. The best buying RV experience in the whole industry. Andrea, show us the kitchen. Okay, I'd love to. All right, here we have uh, some storage up here nice shelf yeah cute backsplash with that nice panoramic window it's a it's a blue lemon <laughs> it does look like a blue lemon we got the mcd shade beautiful beautiful solid service countertop this is what you wanted in your kitchen this is right what i wanted in my kitchen yep and then you got an extension here just it, in case you don't have enough counter. put that all the way up wow, wow. does it go in mm, yeah. uh -oh. oh it's okay well that okay. is better mm. i don't Not, know le le leave it up leave it up and then we have two drawers here. Yes. Soft clothes. Very nice. Wow. Love it. Okay. Even my favorite is they have a farmhouse sink. Yes, farmhouse. I love that. Very cute. Extension here. Yes. And we've got a little storage under here. Very nice. Okay. And then we've got another cabinet up here. Yes, ma'am. Another one up here. Very nice. And then we got a convection microwave. Look at that. Good size. Yes. And then we got the Magic Chef three burner propane cooktop. Okay, okay. The glass cover. I forgot the tower power. Hey, that's a nice tower of power it right sure there. It sure is. That's so important to have it too. And then we have another. Oh, we got a drawer here. Yes. Did I miss that? You missed I all did. of it. I did. Storage there. You know, even missed I didn't this. miss that. Oh, did you show that? Yes. Got it. And then we've got a. I don't know. I think this might be GE. I'm not sure. Okay. A residential refrigerator. Very nice. That runs off your inverter. Very nice. Good size. Yes, ma'am. Okay. And then over here would be this pantry. Is your pantry. Yep. Great pantry space. I love it. But even greater is stackable. Stackable washer and dryer. It's, it's splendid. I love that. You never get in a motorhome this small. You never get big pantry stackable washer dryer and a residential refrigerator. I know. Oh yeah. Well, that's because of the slide, you know. Oh yeah. It has a weird door, but that's So the slide. I totally forgot. This came in second place for the Matt's RV Reviews Awards. And I was all like, why didn't it get first? Oh yeah, I remember. I hate the bathroom. So I hate this door. Um and look, radius shower. Open that oh, radius shower. No. Mm. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, yeah, I mean, it's doable, you know? Yep. It is doable. Yep. Plenty of height and everything, but I, I do see where you... Yes. When you close this door, look at this. I. This looks like, we just did something like this. Was it the Ventana and it had this too? Yeah. The Ventana had these stupid doors as well. Good storage though for linens. Yep. And then I do miss, yeah. A little bit of storage up there. Uh, the, and then the mirror there. Yep. Sink. And then they got this little cabinet underneath. Matt, let me show that. 
Uh oh, and it's on a pedestal. It's on a pedestal. You look really cramped, though. Are you okay? Oh, wow. Here's what I will say. I love this motorhome so much. I cannot do it due diligence by giving it a prime poop position. Not a prime poop position. Eh, denied. But here's what I will say. Pros and cons. As much as I love, I would still buy this motorhome, even though even though there's a radius shower and not a prime poop position. You know what I'm saying? There's, I know. There's takeaways. Yeah, it's always like that. You, RVs are always like 90 10. 90 10? Yeah. Buy it today. It's more like 80 20. And then Andrea, oh. finishing up in the master bedroom. Oh my gosh, look at this huge walkway. Look the, at the this entryway. Uh, <laughs> no. Yes, what were you saying about the. It's, uh, a, it's a good size entryway here. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. Coming in, we have the wardrobe here. Yes. And then the other side. Yes. Then we got how many drawers? Well, Six. First. TV right up here. Oh, okay. Oh. With storage behind it. Nice. And now we uh, have the six, six drawers. big drawers. All soft clothes. Nice. Very nice. We do got storage above here. I love the pillows. I love the headboards. I didn't get that. Could you try again? Shut up, Siri. Oh, and then did I mention this is a CPAP station? CPAP station because she got the little hole underneath here. Very nice. And how then do you, how do you there's like... a wardrobe here. Yes. How do you like the headboard? It's cute. Good, good. You got storage underneath there. Got a nightstand, a drawer, soft clothes. And then the other side, hold on. USB. Over here, same yep. thing. And then you've got another wardrobe there, yes. wherever to hang stuff. Now, Andrea. Oh, let's see. I will say. There is one one thing I don't like about this bedroom. It's a little tight in here. If, it I, is if like, I had to change my clothes or put my shoe yeah, on. It is when you walk around. <gasps> oh, I love this. I forgot they had this. Look at this. Now Every I can tie I my shoe. Now I, I can get it. dressed. Look, you got drawers underneath here. You got a place to tie your shoes there. You can sit here. And then under there, there's like little cubbies for shoes. This is just great. Yeah, it is. And as great as it is, Andrea, and as nice as it is, well, everybody wants to know what the MSRP is. But first, we're going to give everybody three things we love about this unit, three things we don't like about it. Andrea, what do we do oh, first? It's going to be tough. Uh, let's do three things we dislike about it. I got gotcha. you. First thing I dislike, I hate this stupid door. I hate the entire bathroom. I do too. I'd much rather have seen a, a rectangle or the bathroom, a regular shower. The bathroom can. Yeah. I the bathroom's not good. I hate that. I hate that. Number two. Bunk over the cabs, pretty weak. Three hundred pounds. For when you compare this against other bunk over the cabs, it's it's pretty weak. You know what I'm saying? Not only that, like for me to put the bed up isn't a big deal. But to put the bed down, I have to really reach over it. You know what I'm saying? And it's just a pain in the butt. So that's number two. And then Andrea, do you have a third dislike? I can't think of one right now. You're shaking your head at me. I just... You're I, shaking I, your I, head. I, you know, you took my dislikes. I know, I know. It's um, pretty tough. I feel like, I mean, that bathroom should be good for one, two, and three. Yeah. But I'm, I am going to say the third dislike. It wasn't as bad as the Integra's, but there was carpet in the storage underneath. Wasn't there? No. There wasn't any carpet in there. I'm pretty sure there was carpet. There wasn't. I'm old chat. Andrea. What? Is there? No. -uh. uh huh. Really? Oh no. Okay. Again. Oh wow! I didn't see that. It just looked gray to me. Okay. Again. That's not even that big of a deal. But again, I, I'm telling you, I cannot find three dislikes about this. Oh yeah, I'll combo it with this. Like, come on. You know what it's I'm saying? very little, it's kind of no Come point. on, exactly. Don't even, don't pretend like you're giving me one, you know. Andrea, now it's- It should have been right here, actually. Right. 
That's three things we dislike about it. Now it's time for three things we love about it. Oh, gosh. But can I say something? Everything. Oh, I'm telling you. Everything. I love everything about this motorhome. Can I get a 30-second shot clock, please? You ready? Love the LED lights. Love the dual color. Soft clothes. Skylight. Kitchen. Dream countertop right there, Andre is pointing to. Residential refrigerator. I do have another dislike. Love the theater seats, how it's directly across from the entertainment center. Andrea, continue on with the likes. Love that you get this huge pantry. What else? I love the washer and dryer. What else? Stackable. I love the, yeah, stackable. I love the king size bed. What else? I love this. Yes. This is fantastic. Yes. Um, Five, I love, I love, four, I love the, the, three, the colors in two, here. One. The colors. And the full body paint. And the full body paint. And the outside kitchen. Yes. Freaking amazing. I love everything about this motorhome. Coachman sucked on the last review. But they headed out of the ballpark with this one. And they killed it on this one. Killed it. I do have one more dislike. I just remembered. And again, I'm giving all these dislikes to be critical. What's up with this? I don't know. Like it should have a framing around it. Exactly, or exactly. That's a little. Maybe they want to put bigger refrigerators in there. I don't know. Yeah, maybe they ran out of the big ones. Like it's okay. They they should have filled that. And again, just a skylight oh, here. Beautiful. Just beautiful, Andrea. Why couldn't we buy this? <laughs> Andrea, do you know what time it is? It's, it's now time, time for, for the, the MSRP. MSRP. <laughs> $209,436. MSRP? MSRP. That is a little pricey, man. I mean, the, the, these RVs, they have been going up. But again, that's why I'm saying, that's why I said full body paint. It's like $199,000 without full body paint, two hundred nine dollars with body paint. You might as well get the body paint. That's MSRP, but that's not sale price. And again, guys, if you're interested in this, we are now partnered with RV Retailer. So it doesn't matter where you live in the country, New York, Texas, Florida, or California. We have over 80 dealerships nationwide. Contact us. We will hook you up with our closest, our closest Coachman dealership to you, and we will sell you one of these, and we'll get you a phenomenal price. Guys, we're going to give you a great price. We're going to give you great service before, during, and after the sale, and quite frankly, the best RV buying experience on YouTube, in the world, in America, in Texas, anywhere you are, it will be, we're, we're, we're gonna do our best. Andrea, is there anything you'd like to say? Yes, hey everybody, thank you so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things you dislike. Coachman does watch the videos and they do read the comments. Well, hopefully they're still watching. <laughs> we hope so after last week. Yes. But anyways, just, just make sure you comment because you know, they are, they do listen. Again, guys, I say me, I mean we. We have to be loud when we don't like something, yeah. but when we love it, we have to be yes. louder. So drop a comment down below. I hope you guys are safe and well. Thanks for watching. Thank you absolutely everybody so much for watching. And Andrea, we'll, we'll see, see you next time. time.